morning coffee, 5.55 a.m. Time to get ready to run. Just finished running 10 Ks and now we're off to the gym. Morning training will change depending on the day. We might do some sparring, we might do some clinching, I might do some strength and conditioning. But today we did a couple of rounds of bag work, some shadow boxing and some rounds of conditioning where we did 40 kicks each leg and we did that for four rounds each leg. <laughs> Morning training finished and now it's time to go have a shower and get something to eat. Alright, first meal of the day we've got chicken, eggs and rice with a little bit of cucumber. And here we got a little soup. It's pretty sweet. I don't know exactly what it is, but it tastes good and I feel good after eating it. So we're gonna get into it. I'll tell you what, the food quality in Isan is way better than in Bangkok or Phuket. This food is amazing and you feel amazing after eating it. So second meal of the day, it's 11.30. I'm just having some oats with some protein, some pineapple, um, some watermelon and sticky rice. Right, it's 2.40, training starts at three o'clock, so make myself some green tea with a little bit of honey and some beta alanine in there, just for a bit of a kick before training. Alrighty, run is done, did 4.5 Ks. Um, 4.45 pace I think it was, so afternoon is normally a lot quicker. And now we're just gonna put some electrolytes in the water and go to training. After we finish our run, we'll get our hand wraps on and then we'll jump on this tire for about 10 to 15 minutes. We'll do some shadow boxing, some bag work, some pad work. And after that, we'll do a little bit of sparring, some clinching and finish off with our kicks and knees on the bag. And a lot of technical stuff is usually happening in the afternoon. So this is usually the time to learn, whereas the morning session is usually time for a bit more fitness based stuff. And after the afternoon session, I just have a protein shake just from 7-Eleven. These are about 40 baht and they taste very good and are very high in protein. And that's followed by once again some more BCAAs or some electrolytes. And after the afternoon session, I'll have fruit or some fruit juice. So I got both tonight, followed up with a salad, a very good homemade salad from the cafe at this gym. And there you have it. That's what I eat during a day. That's roughly how I train during the day. I train twice a day. I train about five to six hours a day. So that's why my diet is very high in carbohydrates. That's why my diet is very high in calories. If you want to stay at a lower body fat percentage and you're not training as much, you probably shouldn't be eating this much. But yeah, that's what I got for you guys today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next video.